Well, number one, awful proud of uh, happy anytime you get a win, uh, a victory. It's a, it's a, you know, awesome thing. You work so hard all year long, and, and anytime we get a win around here, we're gonna celebrate. We're never gonna lose that feeling of, of uh, celebration. Now, it was a, it was a kind of a frustrating win for me. At the, the the penalties, you know, we. Uh, they were stemming on us defensively, and, and they were yelling go, and our guys were jumping, and that's five, one, or two times. But, it, it, you know, I, that was only a disappointing part of the game. But uh, get that out of the way, I thought our defense, uh, you know, played outstanding. They, you know, first two drives got settled into what they were doing, and, and uh, you know, defense uh, holds them out, pitches a shutout second half, and, and that's what we got to do to – to win ball games, you know, our offense was explosive. Uh, you know, we stopped ourselves all night and uh, we got in the red zone several times. And for us to go do what we want to do, um, you know, we got to come away with points. Uh, but at the end of the day, I thought our, our players played hard. They uh, they did what they had to do. They, they defended home turf and had a great crowd tonight. Student body was unbelievable. The white out and our fans of the Cattle Mountain Nation was uh, unbelievable and, and just happy to get the victory. Home, I mean, it was a great environment out here. We didn't do exactly what we wanted to do. You know, we went by 30 points and we're still not completely satisfied. But offensively, I mean, we got things that we still got to put together if we want to be a championship team. Defensively, they played very well, especially in the second half, holding them to zero points in the second half. And um, overall, we're just excited for the win. I feel really good. I got a lot of playmakers around me. Um, it's not just, you know, I'm making the throws. It's my receivers that are getting open. You know, sometimes you, when people go to praise the quarterback, they forget about the offensive line. They forget about the receivers that actually put the work in. So, I mean, shout out to my offensive line for giving me time to sit back down. And shout out to my receivers for being able to get open and make the catch and make something happen. And me and Tyree, we worked on that uh, fade ball since the summer I know and uh, we, we worked hard on it and we uh, we were able to execute it tonight we missed on it a couple times last week at the ECU game and that's just you know working uh working out we can practice staying after practice throwing it you know getting the ball in the air both sides of the ball just trying to get the chemistry down and, and get the timing down on it and you know it kind of showed we were able to get that done 13 and 157 you know of course who wouldn't want those numbers each and every week but, uh, you know, you just kind of go out and, you know, execute the game plan. You know, just do do what you're supposed to do, be in the right position to make plays. And I think we did that tonight. And, you know, we were able to put up a lot of points, put up a lot of yards, I believe just under 700 yards of total offense. So, you know, when we're able to go out and execute and, and do what we're supposed to do as an offense, we can do almost anything we want to. I think we played very well. Um, we, we paid attention to the details. We had a few misassignments, a little mental bus, eye controls that we had to clean up and we told ourselves, let's have a whole new half and let's let's start fresh and let's bounce back and make it great tonight. Uh, I had a I had a great job flying around tonight. Um, coach gave me a role to just make plays and I told him I, I can do it. He held me responsible for it. And I told him that I can be the leader on this team that can help us be in a position to make that next step to make this defense great. Just excited, we gotta keep working and you know, Kicking game, the, the field goal, we got to get that corrected. We're having right. way too much pressure and a block, you know, where we you know, had, had to go for two there one time. So, uh, you know, a lot to work on, a lot to work on to get ready to try to get uh, win number two against East Tennessee State.